Have a meal on us. Learn about a free summer lunch program for kids. Plus, get a hands-on experience while learning what it takes to be a first responder. And finally, make sure you know your rights and responsibilities as a renter. We have these stories and more coming right up on Iowa City Update. Summertime is a great time for children to get out of the house, and the city wants to make sure they have proper nutrition while out having fun. The city is partnering with Horizons in the Iowa City Community School District this summer to offer free lunches and snacks at city facilities for area children. Any child up to age 18 will be able to eat for free at three new locations, Mercer Aquatic Center, the Iowa City Public Library, and the Senior Center. Adult meals are also available for $4 each. There will be no income requirements or registration required, so kids can drop right in to get some free food. It brings a different uh, type of energy in the building when we have uh, kids come in, uh, which I think a lot of uh, members in the community really appreciate. Um, and so we're just looking forward to uh, the conversation and the energy in the building and just connecting in a different way. Lunch will be served at the center at 12.30 p.m. on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday from June 10th to August 23rd. There will also be lunch at Mercer Aquatic Center Monday through Thursday from noon to 1 p.m., as well as a snack at 3 p.m. That runs from June 10th through August 1st. The Iowa City Public Library will also be serving free snacks at 3 p.m. every Monday through Friday from June 10th to August 2nd. You can join firefighters, police officers, and paramedics for a hands-on experience this summer. The Iowa City Fire and Police Departments, as well as Johnson County Ambulance Services, will be holding an Emergency Services Youth Summer Camp. This camp is for students from 6th through 12th grade to show the work that emergency responders do to keep the community safe. Grades 6 to 8 will meet on July 8th and 9th, while grades 9 to 12 will meet on July 29th and 30th. Students will meet from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. each day at Fire Station 4 on North Dubuque Road. Participants will practice skills like using a fire hose, giving CPR, and working with a canine unit. The camps are free and include lunch, but space is limited and pre-registration is required. To register, go to icgov.org slash emergency services camp. Area businesses looking for fresh talent can sign up to take part in a city-sponsored job fair this fall. The career fair will be held from 3 to 6 on September 10th at the Robert A. Lee Recreation Center. For just $35, companies can register to host a table. Help your business find professional, entry-level, or temporary employees. To get signed up, visit our website at icgov.org slash jobfair2019. If you're a renter in Iowa City, make sure you have signed an informational disclosure form. Signing this document is required to ensure that you are aware of all tenant responsibilities. The form clarifies who will be living at a property, who is responsible for utilities, and general maintenance such as mowing and shoveling. The city now offers the disclosure form in five new languages, Arabic, Chinese, French African, Spanish, and Swahili. Get a copy of the form and learn more about your rights at icgov.org slash rental resources. That's our show this week. We'll see you next time on Iowa City Update.